The children of immigrants became doctors, lawyers, engineers, and business executives. I think what happens uh, when you reach a certain point and you start to break away uh, from the immediate neighborhood, and I think it probably takes place right after high school, uh, people have decisions to make. They're either going to go off to college or they're going to go into service, which a lot of my, my friends did. And, or we figure out, gee, what do we want to do? And this little store down the street or this little tailor uh, is not going to make it for me. You know, so I've got to do something that is, uh, you know, a little bit larger. We all did well in school, but my brother was the smartest one and the youngest one. And uh, he was able to get into Yale. He, uh, he, he was very young when he got into Yale. I think he was 16. And uh, we were all very proud. My mother was proud. <laughs> I did have a strong desire to move out of the neighborhood. I determined that I did want to fulfill the American dream, to be successful in a material way. With economic prosperity came the desire to move out of the crowded neighborhood to New Haven suburbs. There, families could spread out, plant gardens, and send their kids to better schools. 